uh, Friday, July 12th, 2024, afternoon edition. Please pardon any visual and informational inaccuracies in this entirely AI-generated News Digest video. Good afternoon, dear viewers. I am your news anchor, Xander Voxius III. Thank you for tuning in to the future of news. AGNDD Intelli Report. We're excited to have you with us here. I will be assisted by my valued AI-generated colleagues in scraping the web for the latest stories and interesting topics and summarizing them for you. And now, headlines of the day, lupus breakthrough. Researchers may have identified disease cause, breakfast with Hawk Tua Girl, national hero, woman bites flight attendant prompts emergency landing, lone star ticks spreading across the U.S., consumer reports, Rice advises Ayuk on 49 ER's contract negotiations, and much, much more. But first, this day in history. This day in... July 12th in history. July 12th, 1470. The Ottomans capture Yeboya. July 12th, 1691. Battle of Ogram, Julian Calendar. The decisive victory of William III of England's forces in Ireland. Famous people born on this day. July 12, 1956. Mario Soto, Dominican baseball player. July 12, 1962. Luc DeVos, Belgian singer-songwriter and guitarist, died 2014. Nick Palmieri. Here is a recap of their Wikipedia page. July 12, 1989. American ice hockey player Nick Palmieri, a former professional player, was born. He played in the NHL for teams like the New Jersey Devils and was involved in trades during his career, also playing in Europe. And now on to today's news. General News. In lupus breakthrough, researchers say they may have found what causes the autoimmune disease. Fox News. Scientists have identified a molecular defect that leads to lupus and autoimmune disease. The imbalance in T-cells and interferon production contributes to the disease. The discovery of a potential therapeutic strategy using small molecule activators of AHR could lead to more targeted and effective treatments for lupus. Average rate on a 30-year mortgage falls slightly, easing borrowing costs for home shoppers. Yahoo Finance. The average rate on a 30-year mortgage slightly decreased to 6.89% offering relief to home buyers facing high prices. Mortgage rates are influenced by factors such as the bond market and the Federal Reserve's interest rate policy, with expectations of a rate cut possibly easing rates in the future. Business news. Woman bites United Airlines flight attendant forcing emergency landing in Orlando. Report Fox Business. A United Airlines flight made an emergency landing in Orlando after a passenger bit a flight attendant. The disruptive passenger was removed by law enforcement. Video footage shows the woman biting the flight attendant and making threatening remarks. The passenger was taken to a hospital for evaluation. Sports news at. Rice shares what Ayuk's priority should be amid 49 ER's contract talks on NBC Sports Bay Area. 49 ER's wide receiver Brandon Ayuk is focused on playing football despite contract extension talks. Jerry Rice emphasized the importance of Ayuk showcasing his abilities on the field and not letting the contract situation distract the team's success. Caitlin Clark is going to shatter ominous WNBA record. New York Post. Indiana Fever's Caitlin Clark set a WNBA rookie turnover record with 127 turnovers in 23 games, averaging 5.5 turnovers per game. Despite this, she had an impressive performance with 29 points, 13 assists, 5 rebounds, 5 steals, and 5 blocks in a recent game. She faces challenges due to high usage and physical play. Today's obituaries. Billy Ibadullah, brief Wikipedia summary. Billy Ibadullah, a Pakistani New Zealand cricketer, passed away at the age of 88. He had a successful first-class career, playing for Warwickshire and Otago, and also represented Pakistan in test matches. 
Ibadulla later became a cricket coach, commentator and umpire, contributing significantly to the sport. Li Wu Jai, brief Wikipedia summary. Li Wu Jai, a South Korean politician who served as Minister of Postal Service from 1989 to 1990, passed away on July 12, 2024, at the age of 90. Aparna, Indian television presenter, comedian and actress, aged 57, known for her work on Big Boss Canada, Majar Talkies and Masanada Huvu, has been diagnosed with lung cancer. Health news. Consumer reports, the Lone Star tick is spreading across the U.S. Here's what to know. KCRA Sacramento. The article discusses the spread of the Lone Star Tick across the U.S., highlighting its unique features and potential health risks, including meat allergies and diseases like ehrlichiosis and the Heartland virus. It emphasizes the importance of using effective insect repellents and checking for ticks after being outdoors. Entertainment news. We we had breakfast with Hawk Tua Girl, the national hero we need, Rolling Stone. Haley Welch, known for her viral Hawk to Awe video, reflects on her newfound fame as she navigates through first experiences and opportunities. Despite unexpected notoriety, she aims to leverage her platform for positive impact, including potential ventures in comedy and philanthropy. Now a couple of dad jokes for you. I went to the zoo the other day. There was only one dog in it. It was a Shih Tzu. What's the worst thing about ancient history class? The teachers tend to babble on. Thank you for watching this AGND and tele-report, dear viewers. Like, subscribe, and click the bell button to get notified during new uploads. And make sure to tune in next time. Stay safe and healthy. Cheers.